Today I want to share with you something, profound something, that has the potential to transform your life in ways you can only imagine, imagine. For a moment, a tiny seed, this seed, small and seemingly insignificant, holds within it the potential to grow into a magnificent tree. Now what is this tree? You need to realize its potential water, sunlight, and soil, but beyond these physical necessities, it requires something else, something less tangible, but equally vital the space to grow the belief in its own potential to become something more just like this seed. Each of us has an inherent value this potential that is waiting to be realized. And today we're going to explore the essence of acting like you are enough because believe me, understanding and embodying this principle is not just a state of mind, it's a practice. Why is self-belief so crucial? You might ask, imagine walking through life each. Step taken with the certainty that you are enough, just as you are, or how differently would you approach your challenges, your relationships? Your goals, this belief in oneself is the foundation upon which we can build a life of fulfillment, achievement, and joy. It's the soil that nourishes our roots, the sunlight that guides our growth. But to be honest, feeling like we are enough is not always our reality. We live in a world that constantly challenges our sense of self-worth. Am I smart enough? Am I attractive enough, successful enough questions? And many like them can haunt our thoughts, creating a narrative of inadequacy. But here's a thought-provoking question for you. If you don't believe you are enough, how can you expect the world to... The impact of self-belief on our lives is monumental. It influences our decisions, our relationships, and even the risks we're willing to take. It's like the water that the seed requires to grow. Without it, our potential can remain dormant, unfulfilled. But with it, we can rise above our circumstances, transforming challenges into stepping stones towards our growth. Now, I know what you might be thinking. How can I start to believe that I'm enough? The answer lies in the practice of recognizing your inherent worth. It's about celebrating your victories. No matter how small they may seem, it's about learning from your setbacks. Understanding that each one offers a lesson and opportunity to grow. It's about looking in the mirror and knowing that what you see is someone deserving of. Love, success, and happiness. We uncover the power of believing that you are the importance of self-belief enough. We will explore how to cultivate that faith, how to nurture it, and most importantly, how to live it out every day because when you act like you are enough, you open the door to endless possibilities. Your life becomes a testament to the power of self-confidence, a beacon of light to others. We often come across a fork in the road. This fork challenges us to choose between two paths, one that acknowledges our intrinsic value and another that measures our worth by external perceptions. Understand this distinction is crucial for it shapes not only how we see ourselves but also how we navigate the world around us. Intrinsic value is like the sturdy roots of a tree hidden beneath the surface providing nourishment and stability regardless of what happens above ground. It's the inherent worth we carry within us independent of achievements or colleagues or the approval of Others deceive value, on the other hand, is like the leaves of the tree visible to all and often swayed by the changing winds of societal standards and expectations. It's how others judge our worth frequently based on superficial or materialistic criteria. Many of us grapple with feelings of inadequacy, a silent whisper that tells us we're not enough, smart enough, successful enough, good enough. Have you ever stopped to wonder where these feelings come from? They're often the result of comparing our intrinsic value to the perceived value imposed by society. When we measure our worth by X standards, we invariably find ourselves lacking because these standards are not only unrealistic, but also constantly changing. Consider for a moment. The stories we tell ourselves, the narratives that play in our minds like a broken record. I must achieve this to be worthy. I must look like that. To be loved, these stories are not reflections of our true value, but rather echoes of societal expectations. They are the leaves that tremble in the wind, forgetting the strength of the roots beneath them. So how can we reconnect with our intrinsic value and silence, the whispers of inadequacy? The answer lies in a simple yet powerful exercise. Eyes the factus of gratitude and affirmation. Each morning before the day unfolds, take a moment to reflect on three things. You are grateful for about yourself. These could be qualities you admire achievements. You're proud of are simply aspects of your character. 
that make you unique follow this by affirming your worth stand in front of the mirror. And declare I am enough just as I am another exercise is to journal your journey right. Down the moments when you felt proud of yourself, not just for what you achieved, but for the effort you put in the resilience you showed and the overcoming self-doubt kindness. You extended to others, these records become a tangible reminder of your intrinsic value, a ledger of your true worth that is not dependent on external validation in sharing these exercises. I'm reminded of a story about a young tree that stood in a dense forest. This tree looked around and saw taller, more robust trees and felt a deep sense of inadequacy. It questioned its worth, its right to stand among the giants. But as time passed the tree, learned to draw nourishment from its roots to bask in the sunlight that reached its leaves and to provide shelter to creatures big and small, it realized that its value did not lie in its size or the comparison with others. But in its very existence in the life it nurtured in the beauty, it added to the world, recognize that your worth is not a measure of how well you stack up against others, but a celebration of your existence, your unique contributions to the world. The journey of personal growth you are on is a celebration of your worth is intrinsic and mutable and cannot be diminished by external factors. So go through life with the knowledge that we are enough just as we are replaced narratives of inadequacy with stories of strength, resilience, self-compassion. We must remember in moments of doubt that our worth is not determined by the leaves that come and go with the changing seasons, but by the strong roots that anchor us to the earth, nurture us and give us our strength, appreciate us in the center, remember the journey to recognizing. Accepting your worth is not a destination, but a continuous process of growth, reflection, and self-discovery. It is a path that leads to a life of fulfillment, confidence, and above all, a deep sense of self-worth imagined for a moment that your mind is like a garden in this garden. Your beliefs are the seeds. Some of these seeds grow into flourishing plants. While others might struggle to break through the soil, this garden in its essence represents the landscape of your reality shaped and nurtured by the beliefs you hold to be true. But what if I told you that the nature of these plants, your reality can be altered not by changing the garden itself, but by sowing different seeds, by changing your beliefs. This, my friends, is where the fascinating worlds of neuroplasticity and the quantum field intersect with our daily lives neuroplasticity, the brain's ability to reorganize itself by forming new neural connections throughout life provides a scientific foundation for the power of belief. Just as a river carves out a path through the land cape over time, our thoughts and beliefs create neural pathways in our brains. The more we think a certain thought or hold a belief, stronger and more entrench these pathways become shaping our perceptions, behaviors, and ultimately our reality now dive a little deeper into the quantum cultivating self-belief through action field, a realm where the very fabric of reality is not as solid as it appears, but rather a sea of possibilities here. Our beliefs act as coordinates guiding which possibility out of the countless available becomes our experience. Reality, this isn't just philosophy, it's physics, our beliefs consciously or consciously select the reality we inhabit, consider the placebo effect of a phenomenon where individuals experience real changes in their health after being given a treatment that has no therapeutic effect. Simply because they believe it will work, this isn't just all in their head, the belief itself. Triggers a cascade of biological changes from pain relief to healing mirroring the effects of actual medication, the placebo effect stands as a testament to the power of belief illustrating how our convictions can lead to tangible changes in our physical world. So how can we harness this power shifting our limiting beliefs to empowering ones? The first step is awareness. Begin by identifying the beliefs that limit you. Ask yourself, what beliefs do I hold about myself, others? And the world that might be holding me back, be honest and gentle with yourself. During this process, recognizing these beliefs is like turning on a light in a dark room the shadows can no, no longer hide once you've identified a limiting belief. Challenge. It, is it truly your belief or is it something you've inherited from your environment, upbringing, or past experiences? Question its validity. And the evidence supporting it often you'll find that these beliefs are based on outdated or false information. The next step is to reframe or replace. These beliefs, this isn't about putting a positive spin on a negative situation, but rather choosing to adopt beliefs 
that are aligned with the reality you wish to create, for instance, replace the belief I am not good enough with I am capable and worthy of achieving my goals. This is where the magic happens as you begin to sow new seeds in your garden planting beliefs that support growth, empowerment, and positive change. Reinforce your new beliefs through action beliefs are not just thoughts, they are lived experiences. Take small, consistent actions that align with your new beliefs each action is. Like watering the new seeds in your garden, encouraging them to take root and flourish over time. These actions will reinforce your new beliefs, making them an integral part of your reality. Let me share a story that beautifully illustrates the power of belief. There was once a person who believed they could never be a public understanding intrinsic versus perceived value speaker. Due to crippling stage fright, this belief shaped their reality, causing them to avoid opportunities where speaking was required. However, upon recognizing this limiting belief, they challenged it, reframed it, and began taking small steps such as speaking in front of a mirror to small groups, gradually working up to larger audiences. With each step, their belief in their ability to speak publicly grew stronger until one day they were not only able to speak confidently in front of a large audience, but also enjoyed it. Their reality had transformed all because they chose to change their belief. Remember that the beliefs you hold are powerful. They shape your reality, your experiences and your world by becoming aware of these beliefs, challenging and changing the ones that limit you. Reinforcing your new empowering beliefs through action, you have the power to transform your garden. Your mind and ultimately your life, there is power. Our beliefs are the seeds of our reality. And it is within our power to cultivate a garden that flourishes with possibility, growth, and fulfillment. Often find ourselves at a crossroads where our thoughts, emotions, and action seem to be pulling us in different directions. It's in these moments that we must, must remember the power of alignment when our thoughts, the seeds of our future realities align with our emotions, the fuel for our actions, we set the stage for transformative action. But how do we achieve this alignment? How do we ensure that what we think, feel, and do are in harmony, propelling us toward our desired future? The answer, my friends, lies in the ancient practice of meditation, a tool that has the power to transform not just our minds, but our lives among the various techniques available to stand out for their simplicity and effectiveness, the breath and changing boxes. These methods are not just exercises and focus and relaxation. They are pathways to aligning our thoughts and emotions, creating a coherent state where our actions become manifestations of our highest intentions. The breath technique is a powerful starting point. It involves deep controlled breathing that helps center our thoughts and calm our emotions. When we focus on our breath, we anchor ourselves in the present moment creating a space of clarity and peace from which our actions can arise. This practice doesn't just prepare us for action. It ensures that our actions are intentional aligned with our true selves and our goals changing boxes takes this alignment a step further. It's a visualization technique where we imagine placing our worries, fears, and negative thoughts into a box and then consciously choose to open a different box filled with our desired state of being confidence, peace, or joy by this act of exercises for reconnecting with intrinsic value, choosing which box we open guides, our emotional state, aligning it with our thoughts, and consequently our actions. It teaches us that we have the power to choose our state of being and that our actions can reflect this choice now taught about the impact of these practices through the stories of individuals who have lived them. There was once a person, much like any of us who felt stuck in a cycle of negative thinking and in action their life was a reflection of their inner turmoil, dreams, unfulfilled relationships, strained and a pervasive sense of being lost. Then they discovered the practice of the breath each day. They would spend time focusing on their breathing, slowly finding their thoughts and emotions becoming more. Aligned as their inner state shifted, so did their actions. They began to take small steps towards their dreams, each step fueled by a newfound clarity and purpose, another individual found transformation through changing boxes overwhelmed by anxiety and fear they felt paralyzed, unable to move forward in life through the practice of visualizing their fears being placed in a box and consciously choosing to open another filled with peace and courage. They began to see a shift. Their actions started to reflect their desired state of being leading them to take risks. They never thought possible from changing careers to mending broken relationships, these stories 
not just tales of personal achievement. They are a testament to the power of aligning thoughts, emotions, and actions. Through meditation, they show us that when we create coherence between our inner and outer world worlds, we unlock the potential for profound transformation, adopt these practices. Incorporate them into your daily life. Let the breath bring clarity and peace to our minds and let the shifting fields guide our emotions to our desired state. And from this point of alignment, let our actions not be a reaction to the world around us, but take intentional steps toward the life we want. To create the notion of self, worth is a golden thread that weaves through every aspect of our lives influencing how we see ourselves, how we interact with the world, and ultimately how we live today, I want to take you to a powerful concept, one that has the potential to transform not only how you view yourself, but also how you engage with life itself. This concept is known as acting as if, imagine for a moment, what would your life look like if you truly believed you were enough? You stand, speak, and make choices acting as if it's not about pretending or being an authentic. It's a profound practice of aligning your external actions with your internal sense of worth and potential even before you fully believe in it. It's about embodying the confidence and self-assurance. comes from knowing. You are enough right here, right now. The psychological impact of this practice is profound. When we act as if we are enough, we send a powerful message to our subconscious mind. We begin to break down the old narratives of inadequacy and the power of belief in neuroplasticity, limitations creating new pathways of self-belief. And possibility, this isn't just positive thinking, it's a reprogramming of the mind that aligns our beliefs with our actions catalyzing real change in our lives. So how can we incorporate this mindset into our daily lives? It begins with small, intentional actions. Start your day by setting an intention to embody your worst stand in front. Mirror and affirm I am enough. But don't stop there. Let this affirmation guide your actions throughout the day. Make choices that reflect your value. Engage in conversations with the confidence of someone who knows their worth and approach challenges as opportunities to grow and affirm your capabilities. But the practice doesn't end with actions alone. It extends into the realm of meditation, particularly through a technique I call future self-meditation. This practice involves visualizing yourself in the future, having fully embraced and embodied the belief that you are enough Imagine how you would feel the things you would do and the people you would surround yourself with feel the emotions deeply from the joy of achieving your goals to the peace that comes from self-acceptance. This visualization is not a mere daydream. It's a blueprint for your subconscious, a guide toward becoming the person you wish to be, let me share a story of someone who embraced this practice. Wholeheartedly, this person once crippled by self-doubt. And fear of failure began to act as if they were confident and capable. They applied for jobs they thought were out of their reach, spoke up in meetings, and took risks. They would normally avoid alongside these actions they practice future. Self-meditation, daily visualize in themselves, as a successful, confident individual over time, the gap between their current self and their future self began to close opportunities, started to open up relationships, improve, and most importantly, their internal narrative shifted from one of doubt to one. A belief they were living proof of the transformative power of acting as if coupled with the deep internal work of meditation, incorporating this mindset into your life is a journey one that requires patience pro-assistance and a deep commitment to self-discovery. It's about more than just positive affirmations or visualization. It's a holistic approach that involves aligning your thoughts, emotions, and actions with the deep-seated belief that you are enough start small, but be consistent. Remember, every action you make, every decision you make, is an opportunity to affirm your worth and through future self-meditation, allow yourself to experience feelings of techniques for aligning thoughts and emotions. Sufficiency anchoring those feelings in your body and mind, each one of us at some point faces challenges that seem to stand towering before us casting long shadows that touch upon our deepest fears and insecurities. These moments, as daunting as they appear, are not mere obstacles, but are in fact pivotal chapters in our story of growth. They test our resolve, question our beliefs, and in doing so often bring to the surface feelings of inadequacy that we might have thought we'd left behind. It's natural in the face of adversity to feel that perhaps we are not enough. 
that maybe we don't possess the strength, intelligence, or capability to overcome the hurdles before us, these feelings. Though comfortable are a fundamental part of the human experience, they connect us in our shared vulnerability, reminding us that it's not the absence of challenges that defines us, but how we choose to respond to them. So how do we maintain our self-belief when the winds of adversity blow strong? The answer lies not in avoiding the storm, but in learning to stand firm within it, recognizing that each challenge, each setback, is as an opportunity for growth, a moment to practice resilience, and a call to rediscover our inner strength. One of the most powerful strategies to maintain self-belief is to consciously shift our perspective on challenges instead of viewing them as insurmountable barriers. We can see them as stepping stones, each one leading us closer to our highest selves. The shift doesn't happen overnight, but requires practice patience and perseverance. It begins with the recognition that within every problem lies a lesson within every setback. A chance to come back stronger, another key strategy, is to cultivate a practice of gratitude. In the face of difficulties, it may seem counterintuitive to feel thankful for the very things that cause us distress. But gratitude opens our eyes to the myriad of possibilities that lie beyond the problem. It teaches us to focus on what we have rather than what we lack, reinforcing our belief and our ability to navigate through tough times embracing vulnerability is also crucial. Often we equate vulnerability with weakness, but it is in truth our greatest strength by acknowledging our fears, doubts, and insecurities. We give ourselves permission to seek support to learn and to grow sharing our struggles with trusted friends, family, or mentors. Not only lightens our burden, but also deepens our connections, reminding us that we are not alone on this journey. Let me share with you a story of resilience of an individual who faced a seemingly insurmountable challenge. This person, much like any of us, encounters a setback that shook the very foundations of their world. It was a concept of acting as if a challenge that brought them to their knees filled with doubt and fear. But instead of succumbing to despair, they chose to face their situation with courage. They sought support, engaged in deep reflection, and practiced gratitude for the lessons hidden within their hardship over time. This person emerged from their trial with a newfound strength and a deeper belief in themselves. Their story is a testament to the transformative power of embracing challenges as cattle for growth. Take a moment to reflect on the journey we've embarked on, a uh, journey into the heart of our own self-confidence and potential. We have discovered the profound effects of acting like we are enough not just as a concept, but as a living practice that has the power to transform our lives. We delved into the science of belief, uncovering how our thoughts and emotions shape our reality through the mechanisms of neuroplasticity, the quantum field. We've seen that our beliefs are not just passive reflections, but active creators of our world. And we've discovered how practices like the breath and changing boxes can help us align our thoughts and emotions and actions toward a desired future. We discuss the importance of living as if we are enough, a state of being that brings our potential into the present and shapes our actions in powerful ways. Future self meditation emerge is a tool, not just for envisioning, but for embodying the reality wish to create fostering a deep sense of worth and capability within, within us in the face of challenges. And setbacks, we embrace resilience, learning to see obstacles, not as insurmountable barriers, but as opportunities for growth and self-discovery, we recognize the value of gratitude, vulnerability, and community as sources of strength and catalyst for change now. As we stand on the threshold of a new beginning, I invite you to carry these insights with me. You remember believing, and acting like you were enough is not a destination, but a journey, one that unfolds with each step. You take strategies for maintaining self-belief during challenges. With each breath you breathe, and with each act of courage and faith in yourself, step into your power, embrace your worth and live, and live each day as proof of your limitless potential. Let your life be a canvas on which the beauty of your faith is painted in vibrant colors, a masterpiece that inspires not only you, but all who witness it know that you are enough to create the life you dream of a life filled with purpose, joy, and deep fulfillment. Move forward with confidence, with love, and with an unwavering belief your ability to change yourself in the world around you.